and welcome to the first ever virtual state speech tournament. My name is Jeanette Vasquez and I am the president of the Fullerton School Board of Trustees as well as a speech alumni from Fullerton High School. We are so proud of you. I know how hard you have worked and you should be very proud of yourselves too. Congratulations to every single one of you. We hope that you enjoy the show. Hi guys. I'm Marisol Nichols. I play Hermione Lodge on Riverdale. Uh, Sal, Tina Harrow, reached out to me. I got my start in acting in speech, literally in the speech and debate team and competed. So I know what a big accomplishment it is for you guys to qualify for state. That is huge. So first of all, a huge congrats for me. Um, and also a really well done to all the teachers for putting a virtual tournament together so that everyone who's worked so hard all year uh, still gets to compete. So huge congratulations to all of you. Thank you to all the teachers and all the coaches. And good luck, guys. I want to wholeheartedly extend my congratulations to the Santa Ana Unified School District Speech and Debate Program. Congratulations to all of the students for their courage and dedication and using their voice to speak up. Well, this is a competition. You are developing skills that will make your voices even more powerful so you can make changes in society. Thank you to the coaches, teachers, and parents for their investment of time, talent, and encouragement. Your participation will have lasting impacts on these children's lives. Even though not everyone gets an award, just having the courage to speak up and speak in public deserves a giant applause and recognition. Once again, congratulations. Hey, tis the day. I mean, we're here. Everything was going great. Students were working hard and we were all getting ready for our national championships, state championships, wherever we were going to go. Then all of a sudden, everything came to a halt. What we've learned is no matter what happens, we always find the silver lining. We got back, to, we got together as a group and teachers, parents, support staff, everyone said, if we wanna do this, let's do it. And that is why we're here today. We asked our district leaders if we could host this virtual tournament and they gave us the green light. So if you're a part of this tournament, congratulations. You got the green light to participate in something brand new. And here we are at our first ever state virtual middle school tournament. And what you do is important and you're going to find out because there were local leaders and state leaders who have sent you messages as we get prepared for our first virtual state tournament championship. California Secretary of State Alex Padilla, at a very young age, had to lead the city of Los Angeles after 9-11. He is one of the most passionate leaders and has the biggest support for all of you here. Here's a message from our California Secretary of State, Alex Padilla. Hi, I'm Alex Padilla, proud to serve as your California Secretary of State. I want to thank all the teachers and coaches who created this virtual state speech championship tournament. And I congratulate all the students who worked so hard to qualify for this highly competitive contest. Special thank yous to the Fullerton Elementary School District and the Santa Ana Unified School District for collaborating to create this platform for our students. You are all now better prepared to do great things in the future and your families, your community, our state and our nation will be better off for it. So congratulations again, and please stay safe. I'm so passionate about speech because it broke me out of poverty. And this is what I've been dedicating my life to do is to help other students break out through this activity and get college scholarships. The next individual that I'm going to introduce came from low, a low-income family. His mom immigrated from Panama. They moved to the United States. The mother became a teacher. Unfortunately, when our California superintendent, Tony Thurman, uh, was six, his mom passed away. He had to live with cousins, but he made it through. He went to Temple University. He has served his community at the local level, and now he's serving you at the state level. It is an honor to have the California Superintendent of Schools here at our award ceremony. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our State Superintendent, Tony Thurman. 
Hi, I'm Tony Thurman, State Superintendent of Public Instruction in California, and I'm so proud to say congratulations to the Santa Ana Unified Speech and Debate Team. Congratulations on being ranked number one. That is an incredible accomplishment, and we are so proud of you, uh, your coaches, your parents, fantastic stuff. Everything that you're doing in speech and debate is going to help you. It's critical thinking, it's teaching you how to make arguments, and it's teaching you how to use public speaking, something you're going to use for the rest of your life. A long time ago, I was a member of the debate team, and I certainly enjoyed it, and it certainly has helped me in my career. I just want you to know how proud we are of you. You are number one, and you're making California proud. Congratulations. We have so many elected officials here in support of you all, but not just them, entertainers too. This particular individual is very talented and I had the honor to watch her live in her performance in Boston this year. Fun fact, we actually competed in speech and debate against each other in high school. Oh, that's right. And who won? Well, it was back and forth. <laughs> yes, this amazing woman competed for Mr. Tinajero at Fullerton Union High School. She later moved on to many accolades and received her master's in theater at Yale. Introducing to you, Miss Bronte England Nelson. Hello, my fellow speech and debaters. I'm so proud of you all for making it this far. Uh, it's really impressive. I just wanted to first give a shout out to Mr. Tinajero. Um, for pulling this virtual tournament off so flawlessly and for committing his heart and time so fully to this activity over the last many, many years. There are few people who can break down barriers for others in the way that he has, so thank you. Um, I just want to say that speech and debate has taught me the discipline required to accomplish my goals. I learned that it takes a lot of love of something and consistent hard work in order to get to the places that I wanted to go. I hope you all are enjoying this ride as much as possible and when it gets tough remember that that's just part of the path to the larger goals in your life. Congratulations to you all. And claim to be the state champion. will receive a gold medal and become a state champion. So, without further ado, let's start our first event. Here are the state championship medalists in declamation speaking. Receiving a bronze medal from Parks Junior High, Jun Hee Lee. From Ladera Vista, receiving a bronze medal, Sofia Camargo. And from Ladera Vista, receiving a bronze medal, Amelia Burns. Let's give them all a big round of applause. Now, here are your silver medalist and gold medalist. Receiving a silver medal from Via Fundamental, Jose Valencia. Receiving a silver medal from Parks Junior High, Sue O. Receiving a silver medal from the Velasquez Academy, Lauren Velasquez Galvez. Receiving a silver medal from Orange Thorpe Elementary, Jade Salazar. Receiving a silver medal from the Advanced Learning Academy, Isai Alamilla. Receiving a silver medal from Parks Junior High, Irene Sheen. Receiving a silver medal from Santiago K-8, through Ariana Ramirez. Ladies and gentlemen, the rest are gold. Here's our first gold medalist from Sierra Preparatory Academy, Fernanda Mesa. Another state champion receiving a gold medal from the Advanced Learning Academy, Abdiel Ramirez. And your Locum gold medalist from Sunset Lane Elementary, Nathan Perea. Congratulations to all of you. The next individual that I want to introduce to you had a big part in creating the speech and debate program at Santa Ana Unified. It has been an honor to work with him all these years that I've been here back at Santa Ana Unified, and he has a special, special message for all of our students. Take it away, Dr. Allen. Hello, Santa Ana speech and debate students. 
Who would have thought that at the end of the year, you'd be participating in a first of its kind virtual state tournament. It's incredible. We are so proud of you. We are proud of all of your hard work and dedication during this truly difficult time. I, I think that when the decision to physically close schools was first made, the speech and debate, coaches, advisors, Sal and his team, I think it took them about 45 seconds to shake off the sadness of not being able to have a physical tournament and immediately they started planning big. How can we make sure that our students have this incredible opportunity to compete, to practice, to continue moving forward in their skills and their learning? And you've done it, you've pulled it off and we are so proud of you. Thank you for all of your hard work. Thanks to your parents, to your advisors, your teachers, everybody who has come together to make this happen. It truly is a remarkable moment in our Santa Ana history and in the development of our speech and debate program. Congratulations again. Thank you so much, Dr. Allen, for all of your support of our students. Next, it's my pleasure to introduce to you all the dramatic interpretation medalists. Here, are your bronze medalists. From Orange Thorpe Elementary, Yoselin Urzua. From Ladera Vista Junior High, Evelyn Ishikawa. From Parks Junior High, Gabriella Gasson. And from Beechwood, Ellie Yanni. Those are your bronze medalists. Now, here are your silver medalists. From Rolling Hills Elementary, Zoe McLaughlin. From Robert C. Fissler, Riva Sopti. From Nicholas Junior High, Melanie Burrell. From Richmond Elementary, Vanessa Padilla. From Laguna Road Elementary, Ashna Dialani. From Romero Cruz Academy, Denise Vargas. From Nicholas Junior High, Hikari Dow, and your final silver medalist. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Kiara Simmons. Those are your silver medalists. Ladies and gentlemen, here are your gold medalists. From Nicholas Junior High, Ruby Ortega. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Samara Oregon. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Ashley Andrade. And your low Kium champion from the Advanced Learning Academy, Tiffany Ruvalcaba. Ladies and gentlemen, those are your dramatic interpretation medalists. Next, I'd love to introduce a woman who has really advocated for all the students in her city. She's defied a lot of odds. She was a teacher, later represented the city as a councilwoman, and now is the state assemblywoman for us in California. Ladies and gentlemen, Sharon Quirk Selva. Congratulations to the Fullerton Elementary School District for your participation in speech and debate. You have done so well and improved so much. We also want to thank and congratulate the teachers for all of their hard work, parents, and on a personal note, my own daughters competed in speech and debate. Such a great program. I also want to give a huge shout out and congratulations to Santa Ana Unified School District. You are the champions. A championship that you worked hard for, that you made step by step, and that you have accomplished. Congratulations. And last but not least, a huge shout out to Priscilla Arcio, the national commencement speaker. National, that is huge here in Orange County from the incredible speech team that Sal Tina Harrow has led for well over a decade, almost two decades, I believe. Congratulations to everybody involved to support these students and have a great night. Thank you so much, Assemblywoman uh, Quirk Silva. You've always had a lot of support for speech and uh, you, your support has really meant a lot and we really appreciate that you could be a part of this award ceremony. So our next event, let's move on to the funny people. Let's find out who our state medalists are for humorous interpretation. Receiving a bronze medal from La Dera Vista Junior High, Ree Jewel. 
From Mermosa Drive Elementary, Ben Parker. From Parks Junior High, Avishi Bonsal. Those are your bronze medalists. Now for our silver and gold. Receiving a silver medal. From Laguna Roads Elementary, Dia Desai. From Ladera Vista Junior High, Eleanor Murphy. From Mendez Fundamental, Natalia Pedraza. From Laguna Roads, Jane Kwok. From Ladera Vista, Genevieve Payton. From Orange Thorpe Elementary, Matthew Martinez. And congratulations to Amy Rivera. You are the first gold medalist in humorous interpretation. Amy Rivera competes for Sunset Lane Elementary. Congratulations. Your second gold medalist from the Advanced Learning Academy, Alma Rocha Rodriguez. And your low cume humorous interpretation gold medalist comes to us from the Velasquez Academy in Los Angeles, Cat Tam Win. Congratulations to you all. And the next person that I want to introduce is a dear friend of mine. He's one of our sponsors for this tournament. Every time I call him and ask him to support, he supports anything that has to do with public education. I want to thank Vincent Sarmiento for everything he does for the city of Santa Ana and thank you for sponsoring this event. Ladies and gentlemen, Vicente Sarmiento. Hi, this is Council Member Vincent Sarmiento congratulating everyone who took place in this year's virtual speech and debate uh, tournament. I know you guys would have probably wanted to do this in person, but unfortunately it wasn't possible. I just want to congratulate all of you guys for participating, especially the winners, those who did well, but also everybody who sponsored this event, and especially your uh, speech and debate coach, uh, Sal Tinajero, a former colleague of mine on the city council. He's an amazing guy. You're learning from the best. So congratulations on all your uh, future endeavors. We're proud of you. Thanks. Thank you so much for those kind words, Vince Sarmiento. We really greatly appreciate your support. Now it's my pleasure to introduce all of your impromptu medalists. First, your bronze medalist. From Parks Junior High, Allison Lee. From MacArthur Fundamental, Luca Lopez. From Parks Junior High, Cameron Falk. From Hermosa Drive Elementary, Costa Gomez Bueno. Those are your bronze medalists. Now here are your silver medalists. From New Hope Academy, Brandon Lee. From Santiago Elementary, Tony Pantone. From MacArthur Fundamental, Isabella Palacio. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Dante Soriano. And your last, Silver medalist from the Advanced Learning Academy, Sebastian Torres. The rest are gold. Your first gold medalist from Parks Junior High, Sue O. From Via Fundamental, Victor Estrada. And your last gold medalist from MacArthur Fundamental, Jordan Bergman. Ladies and gentlemen, we have so many wonderful sponsors here with us, and one in particular is from the United Way. Sergio Contreras is a big support of speech and debate. He's also a council member in Westminster as well. Here are some words from Sergio Contreras. Hello, my name is Sergio Contreras, Senior Director of K-12 Educational Partnerships for the Orange County United Way. And on behalf of the United Way, we want to congratulate all the participants for this incredible event. We are a resilient community. I know that because here you are, you made it, and congratulations. Thank you, Sergio. And it's time. Let's take a look at who our state medal winners are for informative speaking. Receiving bronze medals from New Hope Academy, Sovi Kim. From New Hope Academy, Michelle Cho. Receiving silver medals from Parks Junior High, Allison Lee. From New Hope Academy, Irene Kim. From Laguna Roads Elementary, Luke Prakarsa. From Parks Junior High, Kellerina Lee. From Sunset Lane, David Lee. From Parks Junior High, Natalie Garibay. 
from Parks Junior High, Yvette Kim from Sunset Lane, Kevin Her from Parks Junior High, Cameron Falk, and the rest are gold. Your first state gold medal champion in informative speaking from the Advanced Learning Academy, Sebastian Torres. From Robert C. Fissler, receiving a gold medal, Riva Sopti. And your low cum informative gold medal champion from the Advanced Learning Academy, Aiden Benavides. Let's give them all a big round of applause. Celebrations like this only happen when the leaders at your school district allow it to occur. I wanna thank Dr. Robert Pletka because he has dedicated his life to education and he has been the superintendent here for several years at Fullerton. Under his leadership, new programs have emerged that have become the envy of other districts. It is an honor to be here with you and it is an honor for you to en encourage the students in your special way. Ladies and gentlemen, the superintendent of the Fullerton School District, Dr. Robert Pletka. Greetings to our speech and debate, our teams, our students, our coaches and mentors, and to our staff and teachers that all came together to help our kids learn new skills in the area of speech and debate. It's been a difficult year and a challenging year, but all of you rose to the challenge, and I wanna thank you uh, for all of your good work and look forward to continuing our speech and debate in this next school year. Congratulations everybody for all your hard work. Thank you so much Dr. Pletka for all of your support in Fullerton. I know on my behalf and all of the students, we greatly appreciate your support and Fullerton wouldn't be the same without you. Thank you so much. Now it is my pleasure to introduce all of your original oratory medalists. Let's start with our bronze medalists. From Beechwood, Cora Durr. From Beechwood, Julia James. From Sunset Elementary, Sydney Flores. From Beechwood, Natalie Brandis. Receiving silver in original oratory. From Beechwood, Aya Maite. From Sierra Preparatory, Jessica So. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Hannah Valdivia. From Laguna Road Elementary, Faye Munoz. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Mia Luna. From New Hope Academy, Roy Shin. The rest are gold. From Beechwood, Sienna Oliver. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Kayla Lopez. And from the Advanced Learning Academy, Grace Tinajero. Ladies and gentlemen, we have so many entertainers who just wanna say a few words in support. We have another Yale graduate and Broadway actor, Mr. Dylan Frederick. Mr. Dylan Frederick is currently playing young Walter in The Inheritance, and here are a few words from him. Hey everybody, I just want to say congratulations on making it to the state virtual championship. Everything that you guys are practicing, all the skills that you're developing in communication and in empathy, uh, those are important things. They've helped me for my entire young career and they will serve you for the rest of your lives. So keep at it. Congratulations on a great year and I hope you guys celebrate well. Thank you, Dylan. It's an honor to have you as a part of our program. Now it's time to find out who are your state medalists in poetry interpretation. Receiving a bronze medal from Orangethorpe Elementary, Elena Mayfield. From Sunset Lane Elementary, Jeremiah Del Toro. From La Dera Vista Junior High, Evelyn Ishikawa. From Orangethorpe Elementary, Michaela Brown Mathoni. And here are your silver medalists. From Beechwood, Caitlin Gong. From Beechwood, Scarlett Clark. From Beechwood, 
Kosi Onubagu, also receiving a, a silver medal from Beechwood, Ira Jawanda. From Laguna Roads, Ellie Sweeney. From Laguna Roads, Trinity Michael. From Via Fundamental, Kenya Montes. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Kayla Lopez. And Brittany, Brittany Casanova, congratulations. You are the first state gold medalist in poetry and the rest are gold. From Sierra Preparatory Academy, Brittany Casanova. Gold medalist from the Advanced Learning Academy, Samara Oregon. Gold medalist from Sierra Preparatory Academy, Daisy Guzman. And your low cum gold medalist in poetry from the Advanced Learning Academy, Ashley Andrade. Congratulations to all our medalists. And the next person that I need to introduce to you is an individual who has been working hard here since 1998 to improve the education of Santa Ana students. It is my honor to introduce a gentleman who has served as the president of the board, the clerk of the board, the vice president of the board, and a lot of, he's a part of a lot of other uh, organizations that help people here in the city of Santa Ana. And that is our board member, John Palacio. This is Santa Ana School Board member John Palacio. Congratulations to our students, our parents, support staff, and teachers for creating the first state virtual tournament in speech. Thank you so much, Mr. Palacio. Now, this is the first ever that we've ever done program oral interpretation. So these students participating in the event are pioneers in speech as well. Announcing your medalist in program oral interp. These are your bronze medalists. From Nicholas Junior High, Hikari Dow. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Tiffany Ruvacaba. Your silver medalist from Nicholas Junior High, Ruby Ortega. And receiving her second low cum gold award at the state virtual tournament, Grace Tinahiro. All right, back to you, Mr. T. Woo, I'm sweating, I'm sweating. It's time to see who our medalists are in prose interpretation. Receiving a state bronze medal from Beechwood, Kosi Onugabu. Receiving a bronze medal from Nicholas Junior High, Ximena Garcia. Receiving a bronze medal from Richmond Elementary, Yaretsi Martinez. Receiving a bronze medal from Laguna Roads Elementary, Mary Michael. Now it's time for your silver and gold medalist. Receiving a silver medal from Sunset Lane Elementary, Emma Day. Receiving a silver medal from Beechwood, Lucy Stetcher. Receiving a silver medal from Nicholas Junior High, Caitlin Kelicoma. Receiving a silver medal from the Velasquez Academy, Lauren Velasquez Galvez. Receiving a silver medal from Fistler, Chloe Chun. Receiving a silver medal from Parks Junior High, Irene Sheen. Receiving a silver medal from Sierra Preparatory Academy, Janessa Parrott. And the rest are gold. Here are your gold medalists in prose interpretation. From Via Fundamental, receiving a state gold medal, Kenya Montes. From Parks Junior High, receiving a State gold medal, Sammy Junior Valenzuela Perez. Receiving a gold medal from the Advanced Learning Academy, Isai Alamia. And your low cum gold medal champion from the Advanced Learning Academy, Abdiel Ramirez. And I want to now bring you over to a very special individual who started the speech program at Nicholas Junior High. He is a school teacher at Nicholas Junior High, but he's also a leader in the Fullerton community. Ladies and gentlemen, this individual has been all about education his entire life. And now 
he's also bringing that component to the city council at Fullerton. It is a pleasure to introduce your councilman, our councilman, from the city of Fullerton, Jesus Silva. Hello everyone, and I, first of all, I wanna congratulate all you guys there, and thank you for your commitment to your craft. And on behalf of the city of Fullerton, as a current council member, and as a teacher at Nicholas, and as a former coach of speech and debate at Nicholas, I wanna take this time and again say congratulations to you all. At this point, there are no losers, there's only winners. You're all winners. And I also wanna congratulate all the coaches and the staff and your teachers who made this possible. So great job, keep going, and again, congratulations. Now, without further ado, it's my pleasure to announce the last event for the evening. Here are your medalists in storytelling. Receiving bronze from Car Intermediate, Diego Silva. From Sunset Lane Elementary, Francis Pack. From Laguna Road, Haley Yu. From the Advanced Learning Academy, Alma Rocha. From Velasquez, Gilberto Santana. From Parks Junior High, Josh Ang. Here are your silver medalists. From Parks Junior High, Sammy Junior Venezuela Perez. From Sierra Preparatory Academy, Destiny Landon. From Sierra Preparatory Academy, Joshua Martinez. From Nicholas Junior High, Bernardo Correa. From Sierra Preparatory Academy, Dominic Cisneros. From Hermosa Drive Elementary, Costa Bueno Gomez. From Velasquez Academy, Kat Tom Huin. From Laguna Road Elementary, Jane Kwok. And the rest are gold. Receiving your first state gold medalist championship from Laguna Road Academy, Rachel Sung. From Santiago Elementary, Tony Pantone. From Santiago Elementary, Alex Pantone. And your low Kium champion from Sunset Lane, Surrey Rain. Congratulations, all of our storytelling competitors. All right, Mr. T, it's back to you. It is time for our sweepstakes awards. Here to announce our bronze medalist is the one and only Miss Finney Vong. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see where these teams came in. Before we go into our sweepstakes awards, I just want to tell all of our students, this took a lot of effort, but we were willing to do it. We did not rest. We have, not, we have been working seven days a week to make this work, but we did it because that's how important you are. Always remember your worth and know that people are watching and they are very proud of you. If you didn't award, win an award, it doesn't matter. We improve. This is what this is all about. So I wanna thank every student that participated and I don't wanna leave out our high school judges who volunteered their time to be judges they, it, of this tournament. They went through training, and I wanna thank Clarabelle Gomez and Justine for your hard work and getting our judges ready. This was a true team effort. Thank you, students. You mean a lot. Let's keep this going. And now let's go to our sweepstakes awards. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see where these teams came in. Your first bronze medalist, Santiago Elementary, Velasquez Academy, Ladera Vista Junior High, and Nicholas Junior High. And now it's time for your silver medal schools. Receiving a silver medal, Sunset Lane. Receiving a silver medal, the Sierra Preparatory Academy team receiving a silver medal. Laguna Rhodes Elementary team and receiving 
a silver medal is Beechwood. These are your gold medalists. The oh, wait, wait, first wait, wait, I'm getting scared. I'm getting scared. Oh. Are we ready to uh, announce who our first virtual state championship squads are? Are we ready to do this? I just, I don't know who it would be. <laughs> uh, let's get this All done. All right, well, we'll see. We'll Here we see. go. Okay. Your first gold medalist. Parks Junior High. Way to go, Parks. Way to go, Parks. Wonderful job. And your other state championship gold medal squad, the Advanced Learning Academy. Congratulations to all of you and a job well done. It's time to celebrate with your families. I want to thank everyone who was a part of this. I want to thank Ms. Vong, Ms. Audrey Togia, Clarabel Gomez and the rest of the team, we had a fantastic team behind the scenes making sure that you were at your rounds and that you had everything you needed. Even when a student overslept, our staff called the parent and the parent woke them up and we let them compete. This was a team effort. I want to thank Jeff Gothard for putting time in to making this event take place so that you could see it. Congratulations. Thank you, Fullerton. Uh, School District, thank you Santa Ana Unified, thank you United Way, Advantage Communications, Kiwanis of Santa Ana, the City of Santa Ana, and, and last but not least, Santa Ana Unified School District. Thank you everyone, congratulations to our medal, medal winners, congratulations to this entire team, and we'll see you again next year. Once again, everyone, thank you so much for participating with us. This was such a great time. Enjoy your evening and have a, a great night. night.